Yo, what's up guys? Uh, for today's video, no, where we can uh, uh, review how to install uh, NS and play NS games in NS emulator. As you can see, I can play this game by using a graphics card on my device. My device is Samsung S8 with a processor Snapdragon Gen 1 with a RAM 8 gig and uh, 256 ROM so as you can see this is the uh, settings of the game I mean driver so as you can see there was a specific details regarding for the driver of my device so my device is not Dragon 8 Gen 1, so I downloaded the driver. Then let's test the game if we can get in. Okay, so it has an ad, so we will skip that. Okay, so I can play the game. So sorry for the late respond because I got busy in my work. So the Pokemon Shield is working on my device by using right driver and right switch droid. Okay, so what's what is switch droid? We will explain it like later. So now uh, we will uh, start from the be very beginning how to install the NS switch droid and import the NSP games so I will I uninstall this application so that we will start on the uh, very beginning so first go to the play store and search egg NS okay so you can see that and NS we will tap that and install okay <clears throat> So, see to it you have a better connection to download that emulator. Okay, after that, you will open the game. So, agree, agree, allow, and allow. Okay, so see to it you will follow. Follow my instruction and log in your game. If you don't have any account, no, just go to the description and I will give you the link. To register the game okay so it's very easy after you register just log in so I will convert up my password because <laughs> it's permitted after you, do, you log in you will see this interface just close it it then you will go to this tree line in the right side okay then game setting you will go to game setting then, as you can see, there was a data directory and XNI NSP storage location. For the data directory, you will use a switch droid. So, how will you get the switch droid? Go to the browser. <clears throat> then, go to the Google. Then, you will search NS. After you search, you will see this website. So this is the official website of NS, and you will see the instruction there how to download. But I will teach you to this video. Just tap the get started, and you will see the switch droid on the left side. So after you download that, you will put this switch droid in this data directory. Then go to the switch drawing, just tap it in, and you will see a new tab for verification. There, were, there was a two step verification, do not worry. So just follow me. Okay, so after you tap the first verification, there was a 15 seconds loading screen. You will wait it up until it finished to proceed to step two.
Okay, just stop the verify. So you will wait. Okay, so just continue. And you will get this GP links. Just tap the jet that links. Get link, I mean. Okay, so the switch droid will cost 400 MBC TAT of a better connection and higher if you use data. It is TAT of a big data storage or amount. Okay, so after you download, just tap the data directory and extract first the switch droid after you download the switch droid on your downloads in your storage. Okay, so after you download and you extract it, move to the folder uh, where you put your NSP file so that you will be not You will put the NSP, the switch drive to your NSP folder. Then you will add in the data directory. Go to the game setting. Then add <coughs> for the date. <coughs> for the data directory, you will go to the switch droid. Situate, you will go to the inside. Then click allow. Then use this folder. Wait for the loading screen. Disappear. Then for the NSP location, just tap on add. Okay. Then you will find the NSP folder when where the NSP file is. Then use this folder. Allow. Then after that, you will see the game on the home menu of your emulator. So we will test it out. Then we will test the game if it is working so as you can see we can create files we can create character i mean so let's put ben tv so don't forget to subscribe guys okay then tap yes now it's saving so it's working on my device and if you follow me just do the step and don't forget to comment if you don't get the instruction i did 
So, the game is perfectly working. So far, smooth in my device. Um, then, let's test the key if it's working. Okay, for mine, it's working. So, I used on uh, the screen button, but it, 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 it still worked in uh, gamepad. Wireless pad, I mean. Okay, so next video, we will uh, say... Or we will teach how to download ROMs and again S. So see to it, subscribe, guys. Okay, so so that you will notify for my next upload. Thank you very much.